and welcome to Dolphin News, where we will be learning about dolphins, and you'll get a story time to read about some any other ocean creatures. Now, we will be, me first, showing you about my clipboard of dolphins. Here's the dolphin clipboard. Now, on the first episode, I showed you the first page. Now I'm going to show you my second page. Today we will be learning on how many dolphin species there are. Now there are 33 types of dolphins, and there are four types of river dolphins, and six types of porpoises. Now I can't read them all because that would take too long of a time. You can search them on the internet. That's all for this section. Now, here is L. I hope you enjoyed my section with V. Now we're going to join L for story time. Hi, welcome back to day two of story time, where we read from oceans. You can learn about dolphins, sharks, penguins, and many more other ocean animals. Today, we're going to be reading and learning about the jellyfish. I know some of you are afraid of jellyfish, and I kind of am too, but we need to respect them and learn about how cool they really are. So let's dive in. <laughs> dive? Okay. We're going to have some great pictures in a moment. Jellyfish. See-through, squishy, and mostly blind, jellyfish bob along in the water with the rhythm of the waves and the current. Tiny, venomous cells on endless, flapping, and flowing tentacles stun the shrimp, fish, and other sea creatures that have the misfortune of swimming across their path. Without digestive tracts, these blobby creatures use their stomach juices to liquefy their food and prey. Gross. It's not an insult to say that a jelly is brainless. These gelatin-like creatures really don't have brains. A jelly actually isn't even a fish, even though we say jellyfish. It's a drifting animal that can move up and down, but really has little control over where it floats sideways. Emerging from its egg, a young jellyfish soon becomes a polyp, or a little mouth-like shape, facing up in the air, surrounded by tiny tentacles. The polyp attaches to just about anything, such as a rock or coral. Eventually, it turns into a tiny jellyfish, called an ephra with an umbrella-like body, and it just swings and sways. The ephra is only about a millimeter wide, but most young jellies will chow down on plankton, almost non-stop, until they become an adult jellyfish, called a medusus. While jellyfish stings can be deadly to some creatures, for others like sea turtles and fish, jellies make a wonderful wiggly meal. Well, that's kind of gross, but that's all we have for today. Join us again on Storytime with Dolphin News, V&A.